some safety tips that you gotta know. And trust me, it's something that you wanna hear. So honey, sip your lips and enjoy the show before we move into the stratosphere. Yeah. Welcome on board Greenway School Year 1617. Our school is under the command of Principal Dr. Hagigod, assisted by Mr. Danner. They have informed me that our school day will be approximately six hours and 40 minutes. While we're here to ensure that you have a comfortable learning adventure with us today, we are also concerned about your safety. With that in mind, we ask that you pay close attention as we perform our safety demonstration. Your notebook has been designed for easy taking and reviewing of notes. To take notes, simply open the notebook and use a pen or pencil to write your notes in the large area on the right side of the page. To review, simply group the notes by topic on the left and then summarize on the bottom. Your notebook should always be with you when at school. You are in a middle school. There are three restrooms, one by the cafeteria, two in the main school area. Each restroom is clearly marked with a blue boys or girls sign. To use the restroom, simply fill out the hallway passport for the quarter it is and present it to the teacher. Be sure to fill out the date, time out, and in. This can also be used to go to the nurse, library, or any other location on campus. Please take a moment to locate the restroom nearest to you, keeping in mind that the closest restroom may be behind you. In the unlikely event of a fire, alerts will sound. When this happens, please calmly line up at the classroom door and proceed to the exit marked by the map by your door. During the alarm, you must remain silent for the safety of yourself and those around you. If exit routes change, you will be informed by the nearest staff member. This school is equipped with food service located in the cafeteria and in your first period classroom. Should you desire food, you may acquire food in your first period class during the first 15 minutes or during your lunch period in the cafeteria. As always, correct lunch numbers are appreciated. The classroom content is controlled for your comfort. However, should it become necessary to continue instruction beyond the school day, homework will automatically fall from the teacher's hand above you. Reach out and do your homework. This action will start the flow of knowledge. Place your name on the line provided and turn it in when requested. Even though knowledge is flowing, your head may not inflate. If you are learning with distracting students or are seated next to someone who needs assistance, complete the homework yourself first, then offer assistance. Continue completing the homework until advised by a staff member. In the unlikely event of a water landing, each classroom has two doors, one that you came through and one alternative exit. None of these doors are equipped with slides or wraps that may not be used as flotation devices. The front doors are equipped with a teacher. Really, if we have a water landing, we're in big trouble. Your individual planner is located in your binder beneath your seat. Should its use become necessary, remove it from the plastic binder, open it to the appropriate date, and proceed to write your assignments down. As you exit the school, refer to the planner by opening it to the appropriate date and read your assignments. In preparation for learning, please ensure that your seat is in your seat and your brain is in their full awake and learning positions. Your notebook is out in front of you, and all your carry-on items are securely stowed in your backpack. Greenway regulations require students to comply with student information signs, other posted signs, and staff member instructions. Please observe the PDID and other signs until they have been removed by the principal. They won't be. The no smoking sign will remain illuminated for the duration of the year, and smoking is prohibited throughout the school and in the lavatories. All lavatories are equipped with smoke detection systems, and federal law prohibits tampering with, disabling, or destroying these systems. School regulations require that you turn off and stow any phones or other personal electronic devices that you may have brought with you. If a device is allowed to be used on campus, you will be informed by a staff member at that time. Thank you for your attention. We will be learning shortly.